Good morning guys. Welcome to my brunch vlog. Brunch vlog? Sorry to be extremely basic, but not gonna lie, I do love getting brunch. It's just really nice to go out with friends, you know, catch up and get really nice food, which I know is really overpriced, but it's still really good. But yeah, it's kind of just a nice way to catch up with your friends and go out for some nice food and just have a good time. So not gonna lie, I do like getting brunch and I thought it would be fun to go and try some of the like best brunch places in Sydney. They're not all renowned for being the best brunch places in Sydney. Some of them are, but some just sounded really good to me. So I thought I would just go and try out a bunch of different brunch places around Sydney with my friends and then just kind of rate them, see what they're like. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy the video. Today we're going to Blackwood Pantry in Cronulla. Maya's actually literally never been to Cronulla before. Crazy. Yeah. I've been to Blackwood before and it's lit. And I really want to get this specific brunch thing. But Maya's going to get something that I do want to try. And I'm going to get food envy. So I'm just going to get it with her. <laughs> Oh, this looks so good. I know, I'm so glad I got this so I don't get food envy. I'm getting food envy on myself. Of, like as in for not eating already? No, like, yeah, like I'm going to eat this right now. <laughs> <laughs> this looks so good. I don't have to take a photo. The Americans are real fooders. Yeah. I cannot find where the good lighting is, but that at the sun, there is no sun. That feed was ten out of ten. That feed, so good, so fucking good. I highly rate that. This is a good start to the video. <laughs> Okay, that place was actually pretty bomb. We kind of feel a little bit ill now though, because it was like pretty heavy. Kate, what, what do you yeah. rate that out of 10? I'm gonna give that a nine out of 10. I can't even think about that food, I'm too full. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was good. It was really good. Like I started, I was like, yeah, gangster, that, this was worth it. And now I'm just like so full that I'm like gone. The vegan pesto was really good. And there was also this like lemon oil stuff on the sourdough, which was mint, but all of that was really like oily. Not in a bad way, but just like when you finish now, I'm just like, whoa. Dead. In a food coma. Like in a food coma, but like it was good. Yeah. I rate that place. <laughs> I'm going to be really <laughs> sick right now. <laughs> I feel like um, my little review was really bad and awkward just then. So no, I'm, <laughs> that was good. Good job. Yeah, that was good. Rate it. But yeah. I literally can't rate. I can't do rates. Numbers. No, yeah, it's kind of hard to do a number. Like, it's so specific. I'd say, like... But no, you can't... Yeah, no, it's too hard because, like, like 10 out of 10, lighting. like... Oh, yeah, the lighting was so hard. I'm really sorry about the um, footage because 
it was dark in there. But overall, it was good, nine out of 10. The vegan bowl was nice. Yeah, quite right. I'm gonna say eight. Hayley says eight. service wasn't the best either but I still rate what I got. I'm gonna give it a seven I reckon maybe seven and a half. Ooh. Charlotte? Um <laughs> I'd probably give it a five just because yeah. it wasn't very good. <laughs> they didn't like the drink five and they didn't finish their food either. <laughs> so yeah <laughs> I feel bad for giving a bad review. I really liked the scrambled tofu. I've never had that before. Don't deserve a good one. <laughs> But no, like I liked what I got, like the, the cauliflower was so good and the scrambled tofu. But there were some bits of the actual meal I got that would just tasted like a spoon of salt. But otherwise, yeah. <laughs> Mana and I just had brunch at Concrete Jungle. It was really yummy what I got, but it wasn't like amazing or something extra special. So I'm gonna give it like 
an eight, I reckon. You guys? Um, well, I just had sourdough and scrambled eggs and avo, so for the price, it was like not worth it. Good food, good, the people were really nice and the location was really nice. Yeah, I'll give it an eight, maybe a seven. Mum? Mum really liked her my burger. My burger was really yummy, <laughs> so I'm gonna give it a nine. It was a bit messy Ooh, though, that's because the, good. the bread was very soft, but it was yummy. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, go to try the fluffle. Imagine having a taste test and just trying some avocado. <laughs> Like, like sausage rolls or like burger patties or something. Wow, that no, is not it's good. Really young. Oh, it's good. It's really that was that's but it like reminds me of something. Try. I feel like you'll okay. Like it I reminds literally... me of something from my childhood, and I fucking love it. It doesn't really taste like a falafel. Burger. Yeah, it looks like like a fish finger or something. Yeah, it tastes like a fish finger. Like the fish bit as well. I love it though. <laughs> There's so much ammo, wow. I know. Okay. It's like a perfect ammo too. Do you know what I mean? Does it remind you of something? I feel like I'm expecting it to remind me of something because you said it. Oh, uh, do you like it? I really like it. Yeah, it's nice, but it's not like amazing. Yeah. I think it's bomb. It's good though. Like the rest of the bowl is pretty more bomb. Yeah. It's, it's, nice. good. Yeah, it's good. I rate it. I would eat this again. Okay, just a little update. This is really growing on me and it's really bomb. I agree with Kiara. The beetroot hummus really makes this around the sides. So good. So that place, I mean that place, I used to work there, so I've been there before, but that bowl was actually really good, like it was really good. I don't know what I'm going to rate it though, because it wasn't like the most amazing thing in the world, but it was yeah. it was nice. I feel like maybe... It lacked something, I don't yeah. know what, no, something yeah. roasted like potato, like potato it, Yeah, it used to have sweet potato when I worked there, and the falafels were more fresh as well when I, like I worked the there. Yeah, here I love they the falafels. They were like, <laughs> not falafel -y, but they were good. I think I might give it an eight. Yeah, same. Yeah, it, it was an eight, yeah. <laughs> it was good. <laughs> Oh wow, I feel like that wasn't on purpose. Me and Irene just went to Rusty Rabbit. It was really good. It wasn't like, oh my god, I'm like dying, this is amazing, but it was really good. So I'm going to give it like a eight and a half or a nine. I don't know, what do you reckon? Eight. Eight? I like eight. What else did I give an eight in this video? I feel like I gave other places that weren't as good an eight. I'm going to give an eight and a half. Eight and a half. <laughs> I changed my mind. <laughs> I forgot to include me and Irene shared what we got. 
and we also swapped the bacon for an extra egg because I don't eat bacon and it worked out well because then we shared it and got one each but yeah it was good thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoy the video if you like getting brunch or just want to try out some of these places I definitely recommend going they were really good if you do please comment below what your thought was and if you agreed with the, our ratings or what you would rate things comment below what your favorite brunch places are and yeah so thank you guys so much for watching please like and subscribe that would mean a lot and i'll see you in the next one